Hi, my name is Kayla Hahn, and this is my presentation on the caching behavior in the eastern gray squirrel for the animal behavior class. The focal behavior for this presentation is caching. I've inserted a video here on the caching behavior. I will let it play, but if you look very closely, the squirrel is working on caching his food by traveling with a nut in his mouth. My causation hypothesis is that squirrels cache certain nuts due to the external environmental factor of the nut's tannin content, which is a polyphenol chemical found in many plants in which the squirrels are very attracted to. I found this information on Wildlife Online 2023. My developmental hypothesis is that young squirrels are taught to cache their food through learning by watching the adults. I found information that goes over this by Lever to 2015. My evolution hypothesis is that over time, the squirrel evolved to have a larger hippocampus, which in turn led to a longer lasting memory as the hippocampus oversees memory, learning, and even emotion. This led to more success in caching. My citation for this is from Steele 2020. My functional hypothesis is that storing food through caching behaviors prepares the eastern gray squirrel for survival throughout the winter months as the resources become scarce during the cold months. My citation for this was Broden, 1994. In relation to Cogbooks modules, I looked at the parental investments module. In terms of that, the mother squirrel teaches the young squirrels survival skills until they are around 10 to 12 weeks of age, which is when they leave the nest for good, in most scenarios that is. Some have extended stay until the next litter arrives. Here is my citation page with all my references. As you can see, I have all the references that I mentioned throughout my presentation and give full credit to all of these for the information that I found.